Hello Leos, welcome to Brutally True Tarot and this reading is from 12th of April to 18th of April so let's check what are the messages for you and uh, what you can expect in this week in love messages for Leos Eight of Swords in reverse, Nine of Wands in reverse, Six of Wands, The Fool, and Knight of Cups in reverse. Okay. So, Six of Wands. This person is learning something new. Something that is out of their comfort zone. Something that they never thought they would want to learn. Something that is going to make this relationship better. This person is actually feeling that they now need to live their life. Because till now this person was trapped somewhere. Because we have this Eight of Swords in reverse. So probably this person was feeling like there is some kind of wall around them. They cannot escape this space. They cannot uh, find themselves. And they were struggling with whatever they have right now. And um, now this person feels like they can escape. They can get help from you. They can obviously make the changes that they want to make. And most importantly, they feel that only you can make them feel life once again so probably this person is going through a lot they might have a lot of problems they might have a lot of issues and uh, maybe this person was depressed when you met them and uh, now this person is aware that things are getting better when you are around like whenever they spend time with you they feel like you are healing them you're giving them some kind of positive energy this person is also feeling that they didn't treat you right. So probably this is someone who said something or who did something because they had some kind of issue with someone else. And uh, they didn't think about how you would feel. They didn't understand that they were crossing the boundaries or they were holding you responsible because of something else that was happening in their life. This person is realizing that probably you didn't get your share of attention and love and uh, that's too because of them they were not uh, in this situation to give you whatever you deserved in fact this person couldn't even see okay they couldn't even see um, how hurt you were or how much you wanted them to pay attention to you but this person is now realizing that because of their other issues and because of something that they are dealing with, they ignored you and probably they became self-centered. This person is now realizing that probably they were only taking help from you. They were only um, kind of using your energies for themselves when they were supposed to reciprocate, when they were supposed to make you feel loved this person is realizing that probably they used your energy for healing and um, they didn't actually pay attention to what you needed so now this person is feeling that they need to change something because we have this card of fool so they will be guided by their heart they will be guided by their emotions and nothing can change that this person will not be in their control and I don't think that this person is even thinking about controlling their emotions. They don't want to. And why would they? They feel that they should have done it earlier. They should have told you how they felt. They should have paid attention to you and um, they should have expressed their feelings. So now this person is aware that if they hold their feelings back, things can go out of control and... Uh, that is not going to help either of you. It's only going to hurt you. It's only going to make them feel bad about themselves. So this person is aware that they need to change something as quickly as possible. And I see them acting in this week. This person will not wait anymore. And uh, they can't as well because uh, their emotions are already too much to handle. 
We also have these Knight of Cups. So this person is thinking about the ways to approach you. Obviously, they are aware of uh, what you like and what you don't. This person has read you enough. Okay, maybe you don't know them very well or they don't know you very well. You people have not spent much time together. But whatever time you spend together was enough for them to read you. This person is someone who has got a lot of intuition. And in fact, in this week, they will be quite intuitive. They would say and do things that you would be thinking about and uh, you won't even need to say. So this person will offer you this cup. This cup is about friendship. This cup is about love. This cup is about everything that you know you were expecting but you didn't get and uh, now this person is realizing that um it would be you know best to uh, make up for that right now this person is feeling that they need to change this as quickly as possible because um, they are also afraid of losing you this person is also feeling guilty and a lot of things are there so with the six of wands, this person is learning some things. As I said that, this person is practicing something. So, you know, romance is not uh, their cup of tea. They're not very good with words. They don't know how to express their feelings. And often they end up saying something they don't even mean. And uh, that is what this person is afraid of. They want to correct something. So probably... This person would feel like coming to you and then they would return. They will do something. They will learn something more. And then they would again come back to you. And this may repeat several times before they finally take this step towards you. Before they finally gain this confidence to approach you and say whatever they want. But no matter what, this person will find a way. Because um, that is what they are looking for. And uh, once they you know, choose something or once they focus on something, they will achieve it. This person is very confident and they feel that they will obviously break this wall. They will obviously set themselves free. And no matter how hard it is, it is going to happen. That is what this person is feeling. Of course, this is a general reading. This may not resonate with everyone. The energy could be reversed as well. Also, you can check your moon and rising sign. So let's go ahead and check some more messages for you. Two of Pentacles in reverse. The High Priestess, Ace of Pentacles, Queen of Swords in reverse, and uh, Eight of Pentacles in reverse. Okay. So we have the high priest here. This is about listening to inner voice and this is what is this person is going to do. We also have this ace of pentacles. So this person is now feeling that it's time to offer you this pentacle. This relationship has grown enough and uh, they need to take a step now because uh, we also have this eight of pentacles in reverse so looks like this is not only impacting their love life but this is also impacting their career their health because um, with this eight of pentacles in reverse looks like this person is unable to focus on anything else okay they are constantly focusing on what they can do to be together with you they are constantly focusing on what they can get and um, we also have this Queen of Swords in reverse. So this person could be judging you. They might be feeling that you are being a bit stubborn. You are not ready to listen to them or you are um, simply acting strange because uh, you are not giving them enough attention. But it's simply because uh, they are desperate for your attention and there is still a long way to go so this person could be judging you but they know that you are loyal they know that you have made no mistake and uh, whatever complaints you have those complaints are reasonable and uh, of course they need to change something also two of pentacles is in reverse so you will see a truth in a very different way so 
things are going to surprise you and uh, this person might you know seem to have changed completely let's check an oracle message for you so lots this is what this person feels like they feel that they have lost a piece of their soul and uh, they need to find it back and you are that piece you are that person so they will find a way to you because there is this inner calling this high priest is telling them okay that you are their other half so this was the reading for this week i hope you enjoyed it thanks for watching till next video bye